Hey guys, Mariah Michelle here. I don't know if you can tell what video I'm filming by this look, but I think it's pretty obvious. I'm literally in my full Indian outfit right now. Um, it's pretty dramatic, I'm not gonna lie, but that's just who I am. It's my culture. So if you didn't know, I'm half Indian, and I thought this would be a really fun video to do. I love my culture, and this is what I would wear and the makeup I would do if I was a Bollywood star on the red carpet. And so I thought this would just be a really fun video to do and you could kind of see a bit of my culture. And I am like so obsessed with this makeup and this outfit and I just never want to take it off ever and I wish I had somewhere to go. I put so much effort into this so I really hope you enjoy it. I am wearing every piece of jewelry that I could think of and so I really wanted to like do a full look for you guys. I've got my bangles, I've got everything. I am so in love with this look so if you want to see how I did my makeup and if you want to see the full outfit I'm wearing then keep on watching. Okay, let's get started. I already put on primer and foundation, so next I'm doing my brows with my ABH Brow Pomade in Dark Brown. Today I'm going with a thicker brow, and so I'm filling them in more aggressively than usual, then I'm carving them out with concealer for a cleaner look. Then I'm using my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the usual places, and I'm going to blend that out with my Beauty Blender. I'm also using my Fenty Matchstick in Vanilla to add some brightness just under my eyes and I'm blending that out as well. Next, I'm using the Fenty Matchstick in Suede to contour my face in the usual places. Then I'm blending that out with a compact brush. Now I'm setting my face with the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder and I'm focusing it on the places where I put my concealer. Alright, so today we will be using the BH Cosmetics Daisy Marquez palette to achieve our Bollywood look. So first, I'm setting my eyelids with some white eyeshadow to start off. Then for our transition color, I'm going into the shade Dolce. And please excuse how dirty this palette is, I honestly have no answers. I have no answers. So I'm starting off by putting this shade in my crease, and I'm also dragging it out to the end of my brows for a winged effect. Next, I'm going into the shade Vintage to deepen up the crease and create a base for our eyeshadow look. Don't forget to drag this color out and blend and add more until you are happy with it. So I forgot to show you the color, but I'm also adding the shade Coco from the palette to darken up my outer corner and crease. Keep this color precise and drag it out for that winged effect. This shade is a really nice brown to add to your look. When you are happy with the way it looks, go in with some concealer to cut your crease. So feel free to go back in with those previous colors to make sure it looks the way you want it to. Next, I'm taking the shade Ivy with a wet brush and I'm putting that all over my lid where I put that concealer. So when I'm happy with the way my eyes look, I am taking my Stila liquid liner and I'm drawing a thin line above my lashes. So I'm trying my best to draw a wing at the end. This was a really stressful part of my life, but we did it. I also added a point to the inner corner of my eye for a fox eye effect. This wing took me so long, and now just the thought of like having to do it on the other eye. I don't know, bro. Five times ahead. Well, look at this wing, I need to show you. <gasps> Fire. Next, I'm cleaning up the edges with some concealer, blending that out with my beauty blender, and adding some more powder there to set it. Then I'm adding those same colors under my eyes before going in with some mascara on my upper and lower lashes. So for the face, I'm adding some powder contour to accentuate the cream contour, and I'm making sure my nose is looking all cute. For bronzer, I'm using my usual Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer. And for the blush, I'm using the Milani blush in Luminoso and I'm putting that above my contour and on my nose. Next, I'm using the Duo Lash Glue in black to apply my lashes. Today, I'm wearing the Kiss Lashes in 11. After I get my lashes on, I'm spraying my face with the NYX Matte Setting Spray and then using the Fenty Beauty Highlighter in Kilowatt. Yeah. 
For the lips, I'm using my MAC Lip Liner in Spice, and then I'm putting on my MAC Lipstick in Whirl. We are going to finish off with the cutest little fake moles to tie this look together. Add some more setting spray because this is the red carpet, we can't be playing around. And that is the finished Bollywood red carpet look. Stay tuned for my outfit. Um, I'm not gonna lie, it's literally nighttime and that's how long this took me, all of this. Um, yeah, brown people, we, we go all out, you know? We don't do the bare minimum. We do all or nothing. And so that's exactly what I did for this video. My mom helped me put this in. I'm trying not to move too much because I know it's gonna fall and I can like literally see it in between my eyes, like right here. Yeah, but this is the finished makeup look. This is what I would wear if I was a Bollywood star on the red carpet. Um, I'm not, I don't know if you know that, but, but if I was, like this look, it slaps. And so I would definitely do it. And um, yeah, I love the makeup for this and I love dressing up. I love my culture. And I thought it would be great to do a video on this. But I really hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Like this video and leave a comment down below if there's anything else you'd like to see from me. Follow me on all my socials. They'll be linked down below along with all the products that I used today. And before I forget, let me show you my outfit. Okay, so this is what the top looks like. Uh, and here's the back. And these are the bottoms. It has like a blue trim and uh, this has a bit of blue in it as well. So um, this isn't the one specifically for this outfit, but it goes, so who cares? I put my bangles on. Yeah, love it. I feel so alive right now. These two little things are right here. And then there are these nice pleats in the skirt. And then the trim is so pretty. Look at that. I'm, I'm obsessed with it. I'm obsessed. And yes, I'm wearing heels because it, it is that dramatic. I'm like really happy to be wearing this right now. I feel alive, I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, that's the outfit, hope you like it. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time, bye. I literally... Oh. That's good enough for me. The jewelry, I'm sorry, I'm so out of breath from like existing right now.